So I wanted to do a quick little video with uh, me and, and Sophia. Hi, Sophia, right? Hi. And I wanted to show everybody our half garage here. So we have a half garage. Uh, we have our Christmas decorations, other decorations, all kinds of stuff, appliances, little kids in it, uh, tools, all kinds of stuff. And the reason this is a half garage is because I want to show you what I did. We uh, put a door in, framed everything out, ran some electric, and we created a separate space. We still have to, I, I want to get some plywood and I, I want to cover all this so the wall doesn't get damaged through the other side and also hopefully to insulate it a little better and, and I'll, I'll get to why I'm saying that now in a couple minutes. Um, so what we created was this space. Sophia, you like this space? Mm -hmm. And what it is, it's a multi-purpose room. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a work from home space. It's a, you know, watch some sports space. It's a vintage arcade or, you know, video game space where I'm, I'm going to build this into the wall a little more over here. Uh, it's a, a, you know, gaming space. And this is also a workspace, this desk. A dancing space, right, Sophia? Uh, and, and we also have a projector and a green screen for the kids. Uh, the projector actually is on a mount that I made for probably about, I think it was like 12 bucks. I have a video, I'll put that here. Um, if you're interested, um, so yeah, we have, so another thing I did was I added a lot of electric. Um, so, so there was two windows here. There's a window here and a window here. Oh, TV. I'll show them the TV, honey. Don't worry. You want me to see the TV? Mm -hmm. They see the TV. So there's a window here. Got another window I added here. Uh, and I, and I added this outlet for an air conditioner in the summer. So I think that'll keep this space cool. Um, <laughs> I also painted this black with a Wagner sprayer from Lowe's. I'll link that too because it did a fantastic job. I just wanted it to stay a little darker when we're watching videos and kind of hide any imperfections or discolorations in the wood because it was really kind of kind of old and, and nasty. And um, this really makes it look a lot better. Um, so a couple of questions I had was, um, so I had the garage door opener here. And the reason it's here is because if I would have built the wall here, the room would have been too small. So I had to go behind the garage door opener. But I put this box here to kind of hide it. And also to keep heat, you know, heat from leaving in the winter. Because heat rises and it would go right out the hole there. And I was going to paint this blue like the wall. And just kind of fasten it to the wall a little better. Which, which it, was, it was fastened better. But I was going to paint it blue to hide it. But I, I can't put anything permanent up there. Because I want to have access to the garage door opener. So if anybody has any makeshift ideas that would work good to keep this... Um, accessible, but not so ugly like it is right now. I, I, I'd appreciate them. Also, I was heating it with the uh, Big Buddy here, as you can see. It's a great heater, works great. Sometimes it, it's propane, it gives off a little odor. You have it running for a long time, and, and you do go through tanks a lot when you get some really cold days in the 20s. Um, so it can be a pain running back and forth sometimes, and add up too. It can be a little expensive to heat one room. So if anybody has any heating ideas, as you can see, this is a brick, a uh, brick uh, walled garage, which means that it's basically, it's a detached garage. So I can't just run heat right from the house because there's no house on the other Daddy, side of this. Daddy. There's an alleyway. What, honey? Now there's one. Yeah, it's a brick wall, right? Yeah. And, and, and so to heat this space, it's a little tricky to get any kind of conventional heat. The space heater doesn't really do enough when it's really cold. So if anybody has any other ideas, I'd appreciate them or on... So on how, how to hide this, on how to, hide, on how to heat maybe without this. So, uh, you know, I hope this inspires people, shows them what you can do if you have a garage that you don't really park in. And maybe you want to just cut it in half and you can make a really cool space. If you have any questions about how I did this or what I did, I'd be more than happy to answer them in the comments. So uh, drop a comment and ask. And uh, thanks for watching and I hope this video helps. Bye.